Thousands of New Yorkers and people from around the world flocked to Times Square Tuesday to be part of the nationwide, even worldwide celebration of the inauguration of President Barack Obama. God is so good. I'm, I'm ecstatic. I can't even tell you the words. I'm in tears of how all these people and all different ethnicities are out here to celebrate a change that we haven't succeeded, that they said it would not be possible. Onlookers from as far away as Tibet to as close as 47th Street in New York City came together to share a huge moment in history. I think it's a lot, lot of uh, hopes and uh, positivism. I think he will, he will, uh, he'll make great changes. I think he'll bring lots, lots of uh, positive things to the world. The last time such an event happened was the November night of the election when President Obama first made history. Reaction to the inauguration was universally upbeat and hopeful both for the country and for people's personal futures. But um, the, the next years, I mean, the stay of the country now, it's bad, but uh, I just have a lot of hope now. Obama's brought a lot of hope in me and obviously an awful lot of other people too. Shouts and cheers filled the air as the new president finished his inaugural speech, which emphasized hope over fear. Signs of a new sense of patriotism filled the air of Times Square as onlookers waved flags and sang along to the national anthem. For NewYorkPost.com, this is Scott Luxor.